Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Have a good day. Thank you for visiting my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to share my students' perspectives, opinions, and ideas about the United States of America. In our previous meeting, we talked about the USA, and I have explained in brief about the country from many relevant and valid sources. So this time, I'm going to share with you my students' thoughts, opinions, and ideas about the United States of America. Please remember that the students have never traveled to the U.S., but they have high interest toward the U.S., and some of them want to travel to the country simply because the U.S. is an interesting country to be visited. And, of course, I graduated from one of the public universities in the U.S., so my students feel more attracted to see the U.S. because of that. I hope that you could listen to the voice of this 55 students, consisting of female students and male students in my classroom. If you have any question or feedback or anything you would like to state, please write down in the comment section below. And I'm happy to share and I'm happy to answer all of your questions regarding the student's voice. At last, this video has in, been intended to share the student's voice about the country. I hope that it is useful for everyone in this YouTube channel. And have a good day. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Before we proceed further to watch the student's voice, please subscribe in this YouTube channel. Silahkan di subscribe dan kita berdiskusi secara intelektual in this YouTube channel. Mr. Seth's Corner, Sparkling Silent Silhouette and Intuitive, Emotive and Reflective. Hello, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Wesi Rahman Dani Wahid. My registration number is 1814050031 and I'm from TBIB. Okay, in this video I will express my opinion on how Indonesian students think about You may even be lucky enough to meet and even study with top scholar in your chosen field. Living and studying in the United States will hit us with a lot of knowledge and great experience. This will permanently change our view of our life. Mm, this country guarantees that when we return to our country, we will change to be more confident more open and more knowledgeable and also this will make us a student with a wider perspective when we continue our undergraduate education there we will know that the education system in the United States is very very different from our country there we can focus on our major without having to take, to take other classes that are not needed Okay, although we can be flexible in using our thoughts whenever we want in our learning year. After all, there are several courses that are over several times a year. How extraordinary is it? However, as Indonesian Muslim student, I judge from a culture point of view that the culture.
culture of the United States and Indonesia are very different. Therefore, uh, therefore, as educated people, we must fortify ourselves from culture that have negative impact on us. As we know, the American state is far free in our interaction, and that is very universal professional to be friendly not in Indonesia. Okay, that's all for me. Thank you for attending. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Auli Rahmatuluda, and I will share about uh, what I think of the America as an Indonesian Muslim uh, student. As I know, the United States is a superpower with the strongest military, uh, learned economic and dominant country. Uh, that, uh, however, this factor has not has not always result in international award. Uh, the desire of the other country to trust America with extraordinary uh, power is diminishing. At this point, it could under, undermine Uncle Sam country influence. In fact, the better the image of this nation, more foreign foreign government are willing to cooperate with the us, uh, uh, with the United States government in advancing common goals. On the other hand, it's unbelievable that the the superpower is superior in every way departing from the, the exiled country of the european people america grew to become greatest country in the worldwide uh, influence in fact america decision can be considered the, the world decision because of the prestige uh, of this country it must be admit uh, that this country which is said to be Russian art rifle win all things starting from music, film, social system, uh, and military. Uh, and the, the United States America nickname is dream country that is often given to them by the nation of the world is absolutely not wrong. America uphold women rights, America freedom is number one in the world. Uh, in this country, everything has regulated based on human rights. Uh, one from example is le- legality of LGBT, which was passed by their parliament some time ago. American regulate the freedom as the people do anything as long it doesn't infer uh, with the interest and other of other. This. Freedom is also very broad, not only all, allowing uh, to have relationship, uh, but also matter of religion and right before the law. American society, uh, society is safely deep, deeply respect each other. Honestly, things like uh, this are sometimes still hard to find in other uh, in our country. Uh, I don't have worry. Uh, I don't have to worry about money thing if I go there, uh, uh, such as uh, wars, uh, such as worship, uh, because the campus provide uh, time for student pray or break their fast, their fast during month of Ramadan, and there are many also prayer room or meditation room uh, that can be used uh, for Muslim prayer followers of another uh, uh, for prayer player and followers of other religion uh, for player american respect people who practice religion and they are curious and happy to ask question uh, about uh, your religion practice and why we must do it uh, what i do think uh, how is the weather there uh how uh, can i adapt uh, an environment then how is the food there uh, i i just think like this uh, make me interest to the america countries 
Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Well, I'm Nurul Sustria Ismail I'm from State Islamic University of Imam Bonjol Padang I'm Tadrus English B My register number is 18-14-05-0030 Okay, on this occasion I want to answer the question from Mr. Syed Sandi Sukandi as my lecture in the subject cross-cultural understanding. Okay, the question is what I think of the United States as an Indonesian Muslim student. Before I answer this question, we should know how about United States first. Okay, United States is the one of big countries adhered to the ideology of liberalism where freedom in United States can be seen as very significant. Individual interest must come first. That's why we often hear the term anything you can do in America, anything you can do in United States. That is a question that actually describes individual freedom that is highly respected in the country democracy as big as United States. It is very different from Indonesia which has restriction on what to do. Continue education in United States is everyone's dream, include me. Not everyone who is lucky can be study in United States. Of course, there are many challenges that we have to face in pursuing education in United States, especially Muslim students. As Muslim students living in a country where the majority of the population has a different rel religious background, it is very difficult. Yeah, it is very difficult, such as uh, in United States, for example, where there are still very few Muslims, makes me think that is uh, related to how important tolerance is toward followers of different faith. With different belief, it is certainly a challenge for Muslim students in pursuing their, their education level. Being part of a minority, of course, a lot of things that cross my mind, such as importance of feeling safe when praying. When praying in public spaces, such as libraries or classrooms, because of the sufficient masjid far from campus, it takes a long time of time to arrive masjid so many students choose to pray in public places of course i'm worried if i pray in public places uh, i think how suddenly there are people who don't like muslim and then attack from behind oh my god because in United States we are the f we are free to do something to do anything. That is my first opinion if I study in America. I don't know. I don't know why I can't think like that. Because I never been to America and I don't know more about life in America. Furthermore, I have to fix myself regarding the teachings of Islam because there must be someone who will ask Islam what Islam is. So as a Muslim, we need to acquaint ourselves with deeper Islamic teachings. Not just knowing, but being able to provide understanding to others. 
cultural differences that are very different from Indonesia make us smart in adapting to the culture there as long as we don't violate Islamic rules. Then there is a need for mutual respect for differences. Being respecting differences certainly give as a sense of security to live in United States because other people certainly do what we do. If we are good, the people will be good for us. And so, our minority is the outer door that connects people outside with what is in our fight. Don't worry. Okay? That's all for me. Thank you for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. My name is Lala Yulanti. You can call me Fala. I'm from TBAB. And my number registration 1814050074. Uh, and okay. What I think of the USA as an Indonesia Muslim student. Cultural difference can confuse everyone, especially for. ASEAN student who go to the United States where there is a huge difference between Western and Eastern culture. However, if you have studied them, you can prepare yourself to be better adapt to American life. Uh, and then facing cultural difference, try to listen to the experience of your friend or brother or who have visited the unit state to learn more about the culture uh, so as not to confuse you later. The unit state is composite nation of many people so there is wide um, variety of culture. Yes, uh, most of the people there have a have essential ancestors who come from other countries even if you are not mm, supposed to believe uh, what, what you watch on television you can get uh, an every overview of the general cultural images mm, people tend to be more relaxed and informal Sometimes you can have long conversation with people you don't know while standing in a long queue, uh, which is in an actual incident in the East. And then, adoption is one of the keys a hacker needs in order to adapt to the environment he has just met. No, I am not encouraging you to learn and you to dream, grow a seal, or break your tail in front of a stranger and my tail has been short and can grow since the 6th grade so I am not going to talk about this thing what I will talk about here is um, some things that when we start will make it just faster to a new environment are in this article the United States. Okay, let's start it. First, get accustomed to speaking American English or American are known as one. Speaking people English, oh yes, oh no, oh yes, oh no. So, before you go there, be sure that you can speak um, English properly. Well, it doesn't uh, have to be good as Obama. <laughs> But make sure the other person knows what you're talking mm, about. My English was not so fluent either. But local people there were quite surprised to find out that I was from Indonesia because the talk Indonesia people did, didn't speak English. Next, get used to fast food. <laughs> okay. Forget a rest followed uh, gado gado or special chicken, huh? 
because she hurt she having a hard time uh, finding this food in America and um, is chef and Burger King is only over there and easy adaptive process as I'm uh, sure you are used to eating that food in Indonesia and get used to public transportation America is expensive destination of course especially in transport and one solution is to use the public uh, transportation such as subways uh, and city bus also not all cheaper yes um, this is a uh, very very expensive and next practice weight walking when public transportation still feel costly a practice of walking is another exclimatization with the current conversation of an american seem to be only remaining american that still using british measuring system and the impact is we have to convert this measuring ela an example is temperature they still measure Fahrenheit not Celsius then heck with fit uh, and in sets of meter and centimeters with on pounds not pounds and then where there are al was also distance to miles not kilometers up to the volume with the gallon intense of the gallon the solution is to install comfort on app uh, on your cell phone uh, okay thank you for watching see you Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my name is Angri Saputra my register number at G4 team 050057 uh, I'm from TBIB I'm from TBIB fifth semester uh, okay mister I would like to answer your question in your YouTube video before that I have watched uh for uh, one hours maybe uh yeah but yeah around this around the hours uh, yeah about uh, one hours i have watched your video and i get your question your question is uh, as a student uh, coming from islamic background uh, and ha and you never traveled to usa what you have in mind uh, about usa yeah, I would like to start uh, from yeah, uh, Islamic in USA. Uh, I always think uh, all my life. I always think that Islamic or uh, Muslim in USA is a minority, minority, and there is no uh, a white space to a Muslim there uh, to be uh, developed to develop uh, their uh, yeah their movement their activity uh, they and then uh, because uh, the, ter the, the the terrorism uh, that on behalf of Islam uh, Muslim uh, movement or Muslim uh, space uh, uh, nearer than before uh, uh, become nearer than before uh, uh, it makes uh, uh, USA's people or uh, uh, people in the USA underestimate to the Islamic Islamic people the year and they think about uh, uh, who cares about Islamic uh, Islamic people who, oh, who cares who cares about who cares about uh, Muslim people uh, they are Terrorists, they are due to terrorism. They uh, disturb us. They make us in anxiety in our country south. In our country south, uh, who they are, who they are, who, who who they are, who are they, who they are. Yeah. Uh, 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 people there or USA. USA people there uh, thinking about Muslim is uh, do criminalism, do do violence, do violence and uh, many bad things that 
uh, pointed to uh, uh, Islamic uh, people in USA. That's why uh, I said uh, Muslim people there have a near uh, or narrow, yeah, narrow uh, space to do activity or uh, to uh, development to our their self there or uh, their a uh, job or to work there, yeah, and then uh, about uh, the culture there. Uh, I think uh, USA culture is haphazard in relationship. Uh, they uh, don't think about merit. Uh, important merit is important. They just uh, if they like, they like each other. They are they are uh, happy each other. They do they do uh, what they want to do uh, or having sex, uh, having date. Uh, yeah, like that. Just have hazard. Just uh, uh, they are willing to do everything uh, they want. They they know uh, they don't bend uh, uh, by a religion uh, or their religion um, makes uh, they free to do everything. Uh, there's no uh, rules to uh, uh, to make their uh, bend. Uh, with a uh, one rule, they 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 cannot do that. They cannot do that. They may may not do that. They may not do that. No, uh, they don't want to be a bend or uh, uh, related to or involved uh, to uh, uh, religion ceremonial or many others. They too often like Islamic, Islamic uh, uh, have a three uh, five time five times. Uh, in uh, a day uh, to do uh, uh, religion uh, ceremony, religion ceremony or ceremonial religion like uh, yeah you know, uh, prayer and then about education education in USA uh, yeah I always think education in US is a uh, good best and have has a higher technology there uh, than higher technology than Indonesia yeah, because uh, they have a technology uh, yeah scientists of technology there they they develop the technology there and they are uh, yeah good country there and uh, and have a powerful country so uh, I think about USA uh, USA is a good country and with uh, free culture and haphazard culture and no no mm, no uh, no many don't, don't, don't have many roles in their self and free country and freedom country and they uh, tolerance and they don't want to to uh, to think about uh, other people business and they don't want to disturb other people business they just uh, do their business yeah there's all of me about about um, USA culture or uh, my I my thing or my opinion about all of uh, I think about uh, USA. That's all of me. Thank you. Forgive me for my mistake. Uh, thank you for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi, I'm Kurnia Prilen Mirwan from TBIA and State Islamic University of Imam Bonjol Padang. Now, I want to explain about um, what I think of the United States as Indonesian Muslim student. The history of American Muslim goes back more than 400 years. Although some evidence suggests that there were Muslim on Columbus ship, the first clearly document uh, arrival of Muslim in America occurred in the 7th century with the arrival of salt from Africa. 
scholars estimate that anywhere from quarter to third of the ends of Africa proof uh, to the United States were Muslim. Large number of Moriscos, former Muslim of Spain and Portugal, um, also come to the Spanish colonies, including many areas of what is today the United States. Lots of insult people were denied freedom of religion. Many did practice their faith in a secret and pass it on their children. There are several there are several autobiographies uh, of Muslim self that survive from the period, including some by individuals who were involved in the abolitionist movement and were Union soldiers during the Civil War. After passage of the Immigration and Nationalities Act of 1965, with the number of Muslims began migrating to America along with many other immigrants uh, with diverse backgrounds. The change in immigrating law allowed a highly skilled professional to enter the U.S. Many Muslims who come during um, is the period uh, were from the Middle East and South East like India, Pakistan, and Bangladesh. And America is home to one of the most diverse Muslim population in the world, including people of almost every ethnicity, country, and school of thought. And although there are little few uh, recent immigrants, uh, the demographic uh, tell a different story. Approximately one third of the community is African American, one third uh, is of South Asian descent and one quarter is of Arab descent and the rest are from all of the world. And about one, one half of this population was born in the US, a, person, a percentage that continues to grow uh, as immigration slow and younger individuals starving uh, having family. Like other Muslims who chose to migrate to American arrive seeking economy opportunity and democratic freedoms. The best studies are available characteristic American Muslim today as large middle class and integral uh, part of American society. American Muslims are present in all walks of life as a doctor, accountant, lawyer, and media personalities, athletes, and entertainers. And what I think about America is a strong country, a country that is, my opinion, is the maker of uh, today's technology. And I have uh, read the experience of several Muslim students from Indonesia who study in America. Uh, she is a Muslim woman who uh, share her story in the Twitter. And this president who has then in power was Donald Trump, uh, who prohibited Islamic countries from entering there and made Islam a minority there. But on another story, one of my friends who was also a Muslim studied there, but he did not feel like a minority there. Um, two opinions about the United States or America, they are quite interesting in my opinion, and hopefully uh, I can get there soon and realize the dream of studying there and tracking the trace of Islam there are there. And such as the film um, Bulan Terbelah di Langit Amerika by uh, Hanum Salsabila Rais. Um, okay, there's um, all that's all from me. Thank you. Bye bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Lydia Fitriani. I'm from TBIB. My register number 75. In this video, I will answer Mr. Sayed's questions. The question is As a student coming from Islamic background and you never have travel to the USA what do you have in mind about USA okay my answer is in my mind USA is a very well and big country with all the technological sophistication there 
I thought that was wonderful. This country is a developed country that has a billion man human resources and technological advancement. Then I hear that in the USA, the people are very disciplined. They really value time because people of Zen say that time is money. In terms of cultures, USA has a diverse culture. This is supported by uh, the large number of other citizens who live in the USA, resulting in a cultural acculturation between Native American culture and Orange cultures. From the point of view of a Muslim, when you will search, when when you first come to America, you will certainly feel the difference in several things. For example, selection the food, uh, place of worship, social interaction, how to dress, and so on. As a Muslim, of course, we must maintain our worship in all circumstances. While the USA itself is an Islamic minority, masks are rarely found, so that then you are outside the house, you will certainly find it difficult to find a place of worship. Unlike in Indonesia, where we can easily find place of worship, even though we are outside. Food must also be considered by a Muslim. With this Islamic minority uh, country, we must be careful in consuming food. But in terms of halal ingredients, how to make it and how to get it, it is the same uh, as socializing as a Muslim, maintaining boundaries and relationships between the opposite sex is something that must be maintained. But with the association of the USA community, which is classified as free, it will be a challenge for a Muslim to be in that country. This way is of association is closely related to how to dress, where a Muslim is required to cover his genitals. Even though the USA is, is a country with a Muslim minority, the people there seem to be against Islam because they think Islam is related to terrorism. Even though the assumption is wrong, Islam is a religion that really values brotherly. I really appreciate the Muslims who live there. Even though they are discriminated against, they still hang in there. Uh, uh, so, do I hope that in the future the USA can eliminate the doctrine of terrorism of for Muslims, so that the people who live there, both Muslim and non-Muslim, can live in peace. Okay, thank you. That is for. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Sophie Andriani. My register number 18140500019. Okay, well, today in this video, I will search my views on the America country. Well, my opinion as someone who was born Muslim and live in a Muslim country and has never been to the USA, I think. Uh, America was unfriendly to Islam in the past where Islam is always seen as a religion host the terrorist group in America Muslim can be said to be a minority uh, yes I'll talk some area in America also tolerates Islam such as the existence of of place of worship or uh, our mosque but as we know living America is different from a Muslim country like our country Indonesia uh, such as the culture but the culture of dress that seems westernized and it is custom As we know, America is very famous and advanced of education and language, which make me very interested in learning 
many things about USA. As we know, America is a large country that address to a democratic system and government. In terms of education, this country has a lot of the best university. Uh, that are undoubtedly the quality, and there are also hardworking and discipline uh, that that is uh, very good. And in America also, there are a lot of technology they produce. Apart from that, they also have the largest film industry in the world, and this industry produces many films of international class. Okay, that's all for me. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alright, I'm Fabrina Yolanda. My number registration eighteen fourteen zero five double zero six one. I will talk about America. Let's go. American is known as one speaking people English. Oh yes or no? So before you go there, be sure that you can speak English properly. Well, it doesn't have to be as good as Obama. But make sure the other person knows what you're talking about. My English was not so fluent either. But local people, they were quite surprised to find out that I was from Indonesia because the third Indonesian people didn't speak English. Forget uh, rice bread, gado gado, or pechelele because you'd having a hard time finding two food in America. In exchange, you'll get a McDonald's, a KFC, or a Burger King is usually over there. And easy adapts. Adapt this process as I'm sure you're used to eating that food in Indonesia. Direct use of names. This might sound immodest, especially to Javans like my who were used to the manner as, as a child. But in America, it is normal to call people by their names, no sir or aunt. Our principal regardless of age. Some of my new age acquaintances, such as Earthy nearly to wife my age, came up with a name, without any ad, for example, like Nessersi. Even if you have to do this in America, don't practice calling your parents just by name. Habit of wearing, additional autism, age trans, way for the R is the Institute of Chicago, Standing in line in an orderly fashion is one of the most exciting things I have seen in America. On the top ticket counter of the rug, the, labor, the labor, labor, Liberty Island Ferry Dock, as well as before entering the Art Institute of Chicago. Everyone line up on the path with neither Jocelyn nor cutting each other. A rather rare thing was witnessed in Indonesia, especially at the time of the eating of it ration at the head. Get used to tap water. Another of the perks of a budget trip to America is that we can drink the water right off the tap. One thing that can be done in Indonesia, where a healthy source of water is away from the city, and if at a doll near it comes only from mother's meat. Well, if you want to air it, air it, take a tumbler and reveal it with tap water found anywhere in the United States. Okay, uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello there, it's me, Maulana Azamal Farhan. My register number is 19140080. Uh, this is my tax for my lecture that is what I think of America as an Indonesian student. 
America has stats and various ethnics there. It has a large population and a pleasant nature to look at. Various uh, buildings are also there. Luxurious shopping malls and all kinds of things are there. Not only that, the danger is also very threatening there. Some criminals are also hedging around and the officers they are so specially tried for such things. Then famous clothing brands like Supreme, LA and many clothing brands there like Louis Vuitton and then Hollywood artists with people are still there but there are so problem there one of which is very booming in this years is racism where the gap is speaking and also now the war of American politics also began to be highlighted by the world media in presidential election my elected president carry out his duties and gave what uh, the people need then do the what has what was he promised before then america is a superpower country as we know that is very influential on other countries in the world one of which is my country, namely Indonesia. The threat war also affected Indonesia. For the military war, I think America is very great. There is great of army there. America has a more advanced weapon and heavy equipment, and many armies pass outside their own country. Yeah, this is a great one because there has so many posts outside the country that which start the test posts were just for work. Yeah, the the American government said the government said the posts were just for work. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Industry, okay. Industry is the maybe the most important things there oil then because of the human resource yeah human resource and more advanced infrastructure have also met uh, america a leading country relation between countries are very important because uh, how to help each country because America kind of standing alone maybe Kane <laughs> okay but there are so some areas of America that are less elected because the government of America can reach the place or I don't know but yeah uh, some area in America have less like less about the how to study and yeah many and then poor people there mm. then the most important things is education yeah in America the education is very structured and organized as well as we as as well as possible sorry <laughs> the educators are also very qualified and there have many uh have many university yeah the best university there and then there have been new things since pandemic in my country e learning and work from home is a new habit because we don't do that before and then in America, I think e learning and work from home. Yeah, in America, it's are not new anymore. Okay, there is from for me. Thanks. Isn't that interesting to listen to the diverse opinions and thoughts about the USA from these students? 
The students are Muslim students studying at Wini Mambonjol Padang with me. I am Dosen Luar Biasa at the university. Dosen Luar Biasa means that I'm not a tenure track faculty, but I am trusted to teach the cross culture understanding course. What do you think about their thoughts and opinions? What can you conclude? Or do you have any ideas or suggestion? Please write down in the comment section. Kalau ada saran, ide, silahkan. Iya, yeah. jangan lupa subscribe. Okay? Thank you.